Hello and good day everyone. Welcome to another tutorial by Smart View Kites in, in properties of material. This is a very simple question asking for a strain from a question whereby you are given an area and a force then the young models of that material. But before we start the solution, kindly subscribe to Smart View Kites YouTube channel and press the bell icon so that you'll be notified when we upload new solution. So for this, we are told that a specimen of copper have a rectangular cross section. We are told that one specimen of copper is a rectangle. It have length and breadth that's dimension as 15.2 millimeters and 19.1 millimeters. That's the length and the breadth. Then we are told that it's put on tension. That a force is applied. The force is 44,500 newton then it produced only elastic deformation that is it's within the elastic limit uh, stress is directly proportional to strain we are told to calculate the strain given that the young modulus or modulus of elasticity of the copper that is e is equal to 110 gigapascal so this is very simple we know that stress is directly proportional to strain therefore it's said that stress is equal to young modulus multiplied by the strain so now we have young models but we don't have the stress but we have all the data we need to calculate the stress because stress is equal to the force over the area we all have, we have the force but we don't have the area which you can easily find we are told that it's a rectangle and the area of a rectangle is length times breadth which is 19.1 it's in millimeters but let's change it to meters minus times 10 to the power of negative 3 multiplied by 15.2 also to meters times 10 to the power of minus 3. Calculating this correctly in your calculator you will see that the area will give you 2.9032 times 10 to the power of minus 4 in meters squared. Now I have the area I can easily calculate my stress because stress is equal to the force over the area. The force I'm giving it to be 44,500 divide by the area which is 2.9032 times 10 to the power of negative 4. The stress if you calculate it correctly you'll see that it's going to be 153.28 times 10 to the power of 6 times 10 to the power of 6 is equivalent to mega pascal. So now this is the stress. The question asked me to find the strain which is very simple. I know that stress is equal to the young modulus times the strain therefore the strain is going to be equal to stress over young modulus the resultant strain is now 153.28 times 10 to the power of 6 which is the mega pascal over the strain which we are given as 110 gigapascal that's times 10 to the power of 9 calculating this correctly you'll see that the strain will be equal to 1.393 times 10 to the power of negative 3 unit less because pascal is going to cancel pascal or 0 0.00139 I hope you learn and enjoy in this video. Kindly subscribe to Smart Bucat channel and press the bell icon so that you'll be notified whenever we upload any of our solutions. See you in the next video.